Hi, I'm Alexis Payne. And I'm Brock. Today is Halloween. Happy Halloween, Colts, and thank you for tuning in to Colts Daily News. Congrats to, congrats to the San Francisco Giants for winning the World Series this past Wednesday night. They won it four games over the Kansas City Royals with a score of 3-2. to two. If you're a fan, congrats. That was a big game. Before you go to the ba big basketball game against undefeated Ramirez Intermediate, ASB would like it if you met us at the clock tower and walked over with us in a big group. ASB will have green face paint and also don't forget to wear your spirit wear shirts. They are only $15. The game is free and we will be have a big showing of support. It will be at Roosevelt High School's gym. We've also got a big pep rally coming to celebrate all of our basketball player stars. Go Colts. Congrats to them all. They are undefeated and they are great Colts. Remember, the Hero Challenge this week is to reward fifth period classes daily for participating in Red Ribbon Spirit Week. Today is orange and black, no costumes, no masks, just wear orange and black. Hey, do you know what the Tardisy policy is? <laughs> Tardy policy? <laughs> the first and second time you get a tardy, you will get a warning. Third tardy, you get an email sent to your parents notifying them of your tardiness. The fourth and fifth tardies, you get an after-school detention automatically assigned from Hero. Sixth time you get, just gets ten into tons of trouble and consequences, so let's not even go there, but there's more parent emails, letters, meetings, Saturday schools, tons of not good stuff. Break the pattern, get to class, don't be tardy. Break the pattern, get to class, don't be tardy. One more time, Coles. Break, break the pattern, the get pattern, to class, to class don't, be don't be tardy. tardy. Okay. We'll be back in a few. Just stay tuned. Happy Halloween, Coles! <laughs> hey Colts, we're back. Hi guys, I'm Jalen. And I'm Ebony. Having trouble memorizing Newton's three laws? Well, here are three easy steps to help you memorize. Newton's first law states that if an object is not moving, but... And it, it will stay in place unless it's acted upon by an unbalanced force. So, if Ebony's sitting right here and she's not doing anything, and I do this to her, then that would demonstrate Newton's first law. Newton's second law states that acceleration depends on... 
<laughs> acceleration depends on the net force of an object's mass. So if I were to push or pull a wagon or pull a tablecloth from up under food, it would stay the same. Newton's third law states that if an object get, exerts an equal exerts a force on another on the second object, the second object will result in an equal amount of force in the opposite direction. Well, I guess that's it. These are the three guides to Newton's three laws. That's how you demonstrate Newton's first law. Okay, <laughs> thanks for that. Hey, remember to sit down at the lunch tables? Don't stand around and remember to throw away all your trash. It really helps out our amazing custodians, Joe and Armando. Yeah. Subscribe to us on our own YouTube channel. Go to, to youtube.com slash River Heights Colts. Colts. <laughs> well, that's it for today, Colts. Thank you for watching. And remember that we are the best school in America. <laughs> Bye. Woo, go Colts. I don't know what's her problem. It just, I'm fabulous.